Liels paldies. Thank you so much. And now from Marseille, we will travel to Japan. Uh, there is an interesting organization, EU Japan Fest Committee, which uh, has cooperated uh, with the European Capitals of Culture since 2003. And what do they do? They try to show the Japanese culture in the European countries and to show the European culture to the citizens of Japan. But how it is done? Uh, we asked uh, the Secretary General of this organization, uh, Mr. Shuji Kogi, uh, to tell us uh, about uh, one example about uh, what will change in the lives of Japanese students. Mr. Shuji Kogi, welcome. And those who are uh, watching us online um, may be interested to know that it is getting warmer and warmer here since it's cold outside, but it is warm here in this room. Uh, my name is Kogi. I'm from Japan. Uh, today I want to speak about uh, one project, but uh, before talking about uh, uh, pro uh, this program, uh, I want to in briefly introduce our organization. Our organization is established in 92, and uh, since 93, we have been uh, co uh, have our cooperation with ECOC is uh, continuing, and uh, finally, uh, until this year, we have worked with uh, 30 cities and uh, 20 countries. Uh, <clears throat> I'm very happy, and I thank you very much for uh, inviting me and giving an uh, opportunity to speak about uh, friends of ECOC family. Of course, that uh, ECOC is a Euro EU project, but uh, nowadays uh, ECOC is a global project at the same time. Uh, nowadays, uh, art, is, art is borderless, and wonderful artist has no nationality, no passport. They are, if, it is, uh, if she or he is a wonderful artist, they are loved by many countries. Um, nowadays, some Japanese conductor can be a conductor for the National Opera in Vienna, or some European citizen enjoy the Haiku or manga or animation and bonsai and uh, this is uh, not uh, haiku is not anymore Japanese culture. This is uh, haiku is haiku. The president of EU, Mr. Fan Pai, is uh, famous for the, his haiku book. Well, uh, today is uh, 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 so ninety three. We start our cooperation with Antwerp in Belgium. And uh, today, I, uh, nowadays, uh, this, yeah. uh, we started uh, eight projects in Antwerp, and now that this year we have 77 projects. 12 percent is uh, ECOC in Maribor and uh, Guimarães, and uh, 18 percent is uh, with uh, in a former. European capital. Some of them are still continuing from the, uh, Antwerp in '93, and uh, also the, our opportunity to uh, Japanese artist opportunity to work with Europe ECOC uh, cities. That uh, this is a starting point for the to the new new cooperation in Japan. Nowadays uh, we have. Uh, uh, <clears throat> we have 70% uh, of our project uh, in Japan, the cooperation with the artists from the past uh, ECOC cities. Uh, yes. uh, the, today, so I want to speak about uh, the photography project. It is uh, the beginning that we have. Uh, uh, this is an idea from the, uh, of the Copenhagen 96, and uh, Copenhagen wanted uh, one of the very important uh, uh, project is uh, to think about the uh, urban life of uh, citizens of Copenhagen. And uh, so they selected uh, several big major cities, New York and uh, 
Rio, Rio de Janeiro and uh, Tokyo because uh, they wanted uh, fo uh, to focus on the, those cities, big cities, because uh, they might have uh, some hint for the urban, future urban life of Copenhagen. And um, uh, in 95, then one year before, I attended the ECOC meeting in Nicosia, and uh, where they, there were uh, ECOC family uh, from the uh, ECOC city from the 85 Athens to the, I think, uh, 98 Stockholm. And also Culture Month of the uh, Europe uh, cities came. And uh, finally, we agreed to have uh, to work with uh, photography to think over the uh, urban life uh, future uh, by 24 European photographers. And, uh, yes. and uh, Tokyo Today is the first title of a project. 24 uh, European photographers stayed one month in Tokyo in 95 and uh, they, they, are phot uh, they, they photographed many, many uh, places and many different angles. Of course, uh, nowadays, uh, we, nowadays uh, I think that uh, there are so many things in our daily life. We are looking, but we are not seeing. There are many things are ignored. There are many things are forgotten. So uh, through European eyes and uh, through different eyes, people, local people, will think, uh, who realize the meaning of life and the value of life, and uh, uh, we, could, uh, we could share the common point with the city of, uh, citizen of Copenhagen. Yes. And uh, then the, we, afterwards, the, we, con we started a uh, uh, new project, which is uh, European Eyes on Japan, that uh, we have 47 prefectures in Japan. Tokyo is uh, just one of 47. So Tokyo is Tokyo. It's, uh, uh, Tokyo is a very modern city, and uh, this doesn't represent Japan. And so we, we agreed, uh, the European eco cities, to, to create this project. And uh, uh, from 96 to 2012, we have already invited 76 European photographers. And uh, today I want to introduce uh, one of the project. And uh, yes, and uh, this is uh, Miss uh, Berto Teunissen. This is a Dutch photographer uh, who has been uh, continuing uh, his own project. They named the domestic landscape. He traveled many countries and uh, to the, through a dialogue of local people, he, he took photograph not only the house, but uh, also inside the story. And um, he, yes, please. And uh, so the, the, he was invited as an official photographer of this project. And uh, he visited uh, uh, many local villages and uh, have a uh, uh, lot of uh, dialogue and uh, create a human relationship. And uh, you can see how, uh, maybe you can see the how that the Dutch photographer has a deep communication with uh, uh, local people and Japanese tradition. And uh, this is uh, my favorite uh, uh, photograph with an uh, older lady and uh, who really communicate with a Dutch photographer without language. And uh, they finally they could understand each other and uh, they share the meaning of life. I, and uh, this uh, exhibition, uh, this photograph was exhibited on also in Lille, 2004, and uh, Genova, 2004, uh, the same year. Of course, uh, this, fo this photograph uh, <clears throat> uh, introduced uh, not only the Japanese culture, but the uh, history of the family, also, also tradition and the meaning of life, value of life. 
And um, when that they have an exhibition in Japan, and uh, the Beirut Teonisen uh, visited the Japanese high school, the local high school, and uh, he made a lecture, and uh, uh, he explained and how he, he felt uh, he got from the Japanese tradition, Japanese daily life, and everything. Uh, maybe it was uh, really, uh, it was uh, for the student, this is uh, some kind of culture shock because uh, they have, uh, their idea is the media or so famous camera photographer only introduce uh, Tokyo, New York, Paris and the very fashionable and the very modern uh, thing. And uh, he was, but uh, he just photographed the, he, their own local uh, town and uh, young student. Uh, first, they didn't believe this is not our town. It's very different. It's not the same. But uh, when they look at, uh, they they realize they realize that uh, this is our town and uh, the, 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 he, they uh, they learned a lot of the how different eyes introduce the different aspect. And um, <clears throat> then after the, uh, this uh, workshop, please stop it, uh, workshop, uh, he asked a student, and uh, he handed a digital cam camera for the all student, and uh, he asked, the, please take your home in three days. Theme is two, I give you three, uh, two theme, place where love where you like, and the uh, place you hate. Of course, a uh, student is uh, uh, confused because it is the first time to have uh, such a theme. And uh, this is a uh, house, house, their home and the house is uh, just, they, they didn't, it, it, it doesn't mean many things, just a house place where they sleep. And they didn't care, the family, and they are, they are more, they enjoy more outside to play around with a f boyfriend or girlfriend or discotheque or something. So, the, this is a really difficult, difficult question. But uh, anyway, three days after, the student brought the photograph. And uh, Berto Teonissen asked every photograph and uh, every student about the meaning of the uh, photograph and uh, why they take a photograph, what's the reason that... So then every, every student, all student start to speak about uh, their memory, why they, they love these places, maybe happy memory with the family or grandfather or grandmother or and uh, some place is a very sad place where they had a very difficult time for their life. So then um, I, I was uh, listening to their conversation with a young Japanese student and the photographers, a Dutch photographer, and uh, I thought this is, a, this, is a, this is a confession which never talked by, by, by them to their friends or family or um, teachers. This is the first time to confess their insight to the Dutch photographer. And uh, so, uh, <clears throat> the, end, uh, yes, please. the end of the workshop, he explained, he told, he told uh, our student and how important role cam can, uh, camera can play and uh, how deep the camera can explain the meaning of life. And uh, uh, the end of the workshop, he asked all students, please take a photograph again. You are now 16 years old and four years, you become uh, 20 years old. When you get, uh, be, be become uh, 20 years old, please take photograph again at the same place. But I'm sure the photograph will be not the same, and uh, it will be different. And uh, the, this difference 
probably shows how much y o u grown up as a, a human being. Well, so the, the, we, through European photographer, a Japanese uh, young student, uh, learned something. And maybe it is, uh, we, uh, it is not, uh, we cannot confirm the, how much they gained, but maybe they, they will never forget and they, they will remember in 10 years, 20 years, 30 years. And uh, as I explained, I have been working with uh, European culture capital uh, since 93, but uh, many cities, the end of the uh, year, many directs ask me, what do you think about our culture capital? What do you think about the Maribor? What about think about uh, Gimarayas? But I always cannot answer. I can only answer, maybe we will know how successful it is in 20, 10 years, five, 20 years, 30 years. We never know. But uh, we, through our cooperation with the European capital, maybe one of the very important role is uh, to, to, to create, to give the opportunity for the young generation to think of the meaning of life. And uh, uh, we have, uh, as uh, I explained, we have uh, 47 prefectures in Japan, and uh, now we finished uh, 35. We still have a 12 prefecture. I hope that the future culture capital we can work together. And uh, thank you very much for giving me uh, this opportunity.